Hello artists, my name is Sajid Rahim. I'm a 2D 3D artist and animator. Today I'm going to show you how you can export your AutoRig Pro character to uh, Character Creator 4. So here I have a stylized character already rigged in, in uh, AutoRig Pro. So uh, for uh, to export this character, first we have to reset our all pose. So for this we have to select our rig first and then we have to go to the pose mode and then press A to select all and then again go to the pose menu and clear all transform after this we come out uh, we have to come out to the object mode and then select our rig first and then go to the file and export please do not export your character with F simple fbx because if you export your character with the simple fbx plugin uh, you you have to map your bones manually so it will take too much time so for this uh, reason we are going to select this option auto rig pro fbx we have to export our character through this uh, preset and then we have to then uh, specify what type of uh, characters uh, or bones we have because we have a humanoid character so we will we have to select the humanoid and then we also have to select this one Unreal Engine preset. Uh, why I'm choosing this Unreal Engine preset? Because when we import our character to Character Creator 4, it's uh, it automatically uh, uh, recognize the Unreal Engine file type. Uh, so uh, we can import our character easily, and we uh, we don't need to map our bones manually. Uh, uh, character Creator 4 will take the uh, operation by itself so it will make our all bones uh, compatible with the simple cc standard character after the after defining the humanoid and unreal engine preset uh, if you need to export your character with the facial bones as you can see uh, my character has a fish uh, have uh, so many facial bones as well so i need the, uh, these bones as well so i will select this one facial uh, uh, full facial but if you have your character with the facial bone but you don't want to export your character with the facial bone so you uh, don't need to enable this one yeah uh, this must be off so i need it so i will make this on and then we have to select uh, the rename for manicure and manicure access and ue4 legacy and the add ik bones please make sure this all uh, option must be on and then we have to define where we are going to export our character and then put the name uh, of your file and then hit export AutoRig Pro uh, will take few seconds to analyze uh, the bones and all the things and it will export your character within uh, 10 to 20 seconds Okay, here you can see our character is now exported. So now we have to go to the to our uh, character creator. We have uh, three options to import our character. The first option is go to the file menu and import your character from this uh, import button. And the second option you have that uh, here you can see a uh, create character. If you click on this character button, uh, you can. Uh, then uh, find your character where your fbx file is and then hit import or we also have one more option uh, that uh, just drag and drop your character to your viewport and select the character because you can see uh, our character is a character so this is why we have to pick this one we don't need to pick the prop so we need a character so we are going to pick the character and then we have to uh, again we have to define what type of character our uh, our character is our character is non uh, humanoid but non standard character so we have to choose this one you don't need to uh, uh, choose these option uh, just pick the middle one but if your character is uh, uh, character you are importing your character from blender but your character is character creator for uh, character with all the same bones that character creator for use uh, then you can import your character from this one but we have uh, auto rig pro character all the bones are auto rig pro bones so this is why we have to 
select the uh, humanoid and non standard character after this uh, character character uh, 4 is also asking for the uh, what type of uh, preset or character as uh, as you uh, know that uh, i have exported this character in uh, unreal engine preset so this is why this is very important to select the unreal engine base character if you choose the cc bo uh, cc game character your character will not work in cc uh, in character creator 4 and uh, orientation and the scale of the character will also be uh, so messy and, and wrong so this is why you must need to select the unreal engine base character because we have exported our character uh, for the unreal engine preset so this is why this must be uh, enabled Okay, our character is now imported and we don't need to map or retarget uh, our bones because uh, character creator 3 already uh, have done this. So now we are going to check our rig. The rig is working perfectly. All the weight painting that we assigned earlier earlier for the bones are uh, remain in the uh, are uh, remain on the right uh, location and uh, all the weight painting that we have done is uh, the same that we have done it manually in the blender so now our character you can see is rigged perfectly the only problem we have that our character is uh, not uh, our character has no materials actually our character has materials but we don't have uh, our textures so for this we have to select our body parts and then we can uh, find our textures Okay, uh, so this is how you can uh, then add your all the texture to the all slots. Just pick the uh, selection set or tex uh, texture set set list. Here you can see uh, for the head we have to apply these textures for the head and for the body and for the arms and uh, you have to add these texture to the all to the corresponding sections uh, manually. So this is how you can import your character, your auto rig pro character to character creator 4. So if you like my video, please uh, like it and uh, I will please stick to my channel because I will bring more contents and more new artistic ideas and also I will bring some more uh, free models. Uh, so you can uh, use these models for your own projects and uh, you can uh, maybe uh, get some ideas with my uh, creative skills so you can apply these to your own so this is why uh, I really like to uh, uh, I really like uh, you guys if you can stick to my channel and motivate me because motivation works for art artists like an oxygen so I will bring more content for you guys so until that have a good day